ethics. Leonie, thank you so much for coming to Barcelona and being at our show. Thanks for having me. What would you be able to say about Barcelona? What do you think of the brand? Oh, sorry, about Pronovius. What do you think of the brand? Pronovias for me is um, a brand with a long history, which is known for bridal, but which has a good transition to also rocking red carpets and evening wear. So I think when you think of bridal, it's the one brand which is embracing the whole lifestyle around it very well. So even before I started blogging, I remember all these amazing photo shootings in beautiful locations and girls coming every year to see the show during bridal. So I feel like I knew about Pronovias before I knew about Bridal Week. <laughs> That's perfect, thank you. Um, if I speak too long, you can always cut. I'm a no, long speaker. No, that's perfect. <laughs> um, you're obviously wearing a very, very beautiful dress. What can you say about it? What occasion might you wear this beautiful dress for? So I moved to London last year, so this dress is also a dress I would love to wear to one of these very nice British evening events because in London we have the Fashion Awards, the BAFTAs, and I think it's one of those dresses that you can wear even amongst Hollywood actors and you feel like this is a good dress to wear tonight, which is the most important feeling for women to go to one of those occasions and feel like you're blending in. You don't want to be like, not perfectly dressed. You have to have the perfect dress. <laughs> perfect, perfect. How do you imagine the Pronovius fashion show? Have you seen any of the shows that we've done before? It's my first Pronovia show and I'm really excited to be here. I love the topic because I'm a bit spiritual and I love stars so I'm already very keen on seeing it and I feel like my dress is also matching because of the stars, shimmering, light topic and I hear it's 2,000 guests so I'm thinking it will be very big and very glamorous, spectacular. Perfect. And have you ever dreamed about getting married? So getting married is something every woman and girl is dreaming about. Um, for me, getting married is all about the perfect moment. And my life, ever since I start working, always changed so much that at the moment I cannot even tell you where I live in the last... Because of Brexit, I can't even tell you whether I still live in London in half a year. So we always said, one day, we are pretty sure we want to get married, but it has to be about the timing. It's not for me about it has to be this age. It's more about you feel like you, you are getting settled and it's the next step which makes life even more, even more eventful and you feel like now you have the people around you you want to celebrate love with. So for me it was always about finding the right timing and we are still waiting for it a little. <laughs> perfect, perfect. And what about the wedding dress? Would you go traditional? Do you think you might go modern? So I think the dress should be really the perfect dress. So as a woman, there's a lot of pressure for this day because you want to look beautiful. So I think the dress should just really make you look as pretty as possible. So for me, I love fashion. So I think it should be something fashionable, not too princessy, but still very dreamy and with nice details that you feel like the dress is already so pretty that you feel like it's, it's helping your own individual, like, individual look without being too much so you should still have like a very visible beautiful face but then feel like all oh, this dress is even making me look more pretty perfect. and you, you know you're, you're an extremely influential person a model how do you balance your daily life to balance my daily life for me it's very important to stay mentally and physically focused and happy so there's a lot of things I changed in my life in the last one or two years, which made me feel stronger and happier. So for example, I started with meditation, I started to eat vegan, and I have a super close relationship with, with my friends from school and my parents and my whole family. So for me, it's very important to stay grounded. So even when I have like a spectacular moment and I know like my friends from school are writing like, oh, Leonie, you look like such a cute, famous celebrity and it's so nice because it's something very different when it's your friends that know you since forever and they still feel like you haven't changed 
but then getting the feedback from them like even when I'm on television they always write me they're like oh my god what are you wearing tonight it's super nice to share it with people that also know you from before and I think that's the most important for me and what about your plans on a kind of professional level I feel like the whole influencer scene changed a lot and for me it's very important to be more of a personality and to use my voice and I feel like I started to really build my voice and I want to be even stronger with it because even before I started blogging uh, my first academic work was about glass ceiling and female empowerment and why it's so difficult for women to make a career and also now shifting my career from like the business administration side uh, to blogging and to work in this whole influence industry. I see it even more that a lot of time it's a problem with women and the lack of support and women wanting strong women on their side. So I feel like for a lot of women growing up out there, they need more voices to like believe in themselves. I feel like female empowerment, but really meaning it from the heart, is a topic I would love to speak louder about. But then there's so much to do and I feel like this whole topic about how I can use my voice in the best way. We just started working on this, but I'm really exciting on, excited on using my voice more for good causes. Fantastic. And final question, <laughs> are you ready and looking forward to the show? Uh, I'm so looking forward to the show. I said earlier when my boyfriend asked me, I was born ready for tonight. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank Thanks you. so much.